So I'm just making a wee video to compare the differences of the uh, S13 and S14 rocker covers. So on the right is a uh, late S13 type SR20 turbo rocker cover from um, like a late model Type X 180SX. And on the left, we've got a S14 SR20 DE rocker cover. So the S13 type has the uh, T on the exhaust side there, which T's in uh, on the drains to the sump on the right, and the left of the T goes to the inlet. And then you've got the PCV valve there on a on a bit of an angle. And the other thing that's quite different is the height. So the S13 rocker cover is quite quite flat, where the S14 one rises up. There's quite a lot more air volume, I guess, underneath it. So the arrangement of the the breather hoses is, is quite different on the S14 so the on the back corner there there's a dedicated hose which uh, would drain to the to the sump I guess and then a separated hose there that would go to back to the inlet and then in the PCV valve um, it's just come straight out there. The uh, S14 DE um, is not uh, tapped for any any holes to uh, mount your coil on plug, but my car runs uh, um, separated coils with uh, HT leads, so it's not a problem for me. So the undersides are quite interesting to look at, the little differences as well. So on the right we've got the, the S13 type. And so you can see it's, um, it's quite a bit shallower in this sort of area compared to the, the S14 one. S14's got this kind of blanking there just behind the oil cap and yeah quite a different quite a different setup. S14 has this has this little gap there whereas on the S13 the the gap is up the back there. That's uh, on the in inlet side because they're upside down, and then on the exhaust side they're quite quite different. The S13 one has this big gap here, and there's some um, gauze there, whereas the S14 is all fully sealed around where this um, inlet return tube is. get quite interesting that I've um, drilled out all the welds to uh, give them both a good clean. The S14 one was uh, really disgusting when I bought it so to pull sort of pull it apart to clean it up. So interestingly the S13 one's got these nice little sort of passageways um, into the casting to to separate um, the air from the oil I guess but 
so this is the PCV valve and you can see it's um, it's got a nice little bit where the air would pass around here which is all fully sealed see where that little opening is there and then over on the exhaust side the same deal so the cover sits on there it's open in there and then any mist has to pass through the gauze and then it runs all the way down and through this little section there before it can get out to this to this T piece, but on my car, uh, running you know quite high boost, it was you know a lot of oil was getting in through that system and getting into the inlet. So you think it would work? It looks better. So the S14 one is quite quite basic, which surprised me when I pulled them apart. One thing to note. Um, you know, there's just a lot more volume of air in the S14 ones. And you put that back in. You know, there's a lot more room in between, I guess, the camshafts and this plate. And then underneath the plate, there's a lot more air as well. So. So I guess the, the main advantage of using these uh, the S14 rocker cover has to be just that added air volume, I guess, and then uh, having the the separated um, you know the separated sump return and uh, air inlet return there.